Lego animals come in all shapes and sizes and are often highly prized pieces. While some might be a little too common, others are incredibly valuable collector pieces. Today, I'll be showcasing some of LEGO's cheapest and most expensive animals. To keep things organized, I've broken down the last 40 years of LEGO animals into a few main categories. We'll be looking at sea life, jungle beasts, fantastical monsters, and much more. What better place to start than with the very first LEGO animal ever released? Back in the 1980s, LEGO put out the Fabuland line to bridge the gap between Duplo and LEGO System. The minifigures in this series were all humanoid animals, such as Paulette Poodle. But these minifigures aren't really animals. The first true LEGO animal piece was actually found in Paulette's living room. This little yellow bird in a white cage changed LEGO forever by giving minifigures some animal companions. Today, getting one of these original yellow birds for yourself is surprisingly easy. Used ones can be bought online for less than two US dollars, but if you want a brand new unopened set with a brand new piece, it'll run you close to $150. That's a high price for a set with only 12 pieces. While the yellow bird is certainly historic, it's not the cheapest nor rarest flying animal out there. The most common Lego bird is most likely the dark gray parrot. These came out in a lot of sets and can be picked up for around 20 cents a piece. However, the cheapest ones out there seem to be these brown owls. They can be picked up for as little as three cents each. However, at the other end of the spectrum, the most expensive flying Lego animal that I could find is also one of the newest. This Falcon piece was released in Series 24 of the Collectible Minifigures line and is currently selling for about $4. That's almost the price of the entire minifigure blind bag. It's definitely a neat piece with some great detail though. Moving from air to land, there has been no shortage of LEGO animals released on four or more legs. The cheapest of these all fall in the same general price range, with ants, rabbits, chickens, and even the very first horses all selling for around 15 to 50 cents currently. But the most expensive land figures can cost much, much more. You see, in 2003, LEGO released the Orient Expedition sub-theme of the Adventurers line. This theme had a few neat sets, but of most importance here are these two elephants. As some of the largest animals that LEGO has ever released, these came in two versions, light and dark gray. Aside from the difference in color, the light gray version had an inset back piece to hold the wagon it carried. Today, these will both run you about $50 each in new condition, which is slightly more expensive than the Lego Mammoth that goes for around $35. US Now, while the price of these creatures is largely due to their size, the other two most expensive mammals are due to their very limited releases. Lego's release of the 2017 Jungle Airdrop Helicopter was a fine enough set, but nothing specifically special, until you look a little bit closer at the animals involved. There's a crocodile and, wh what's that? A tiger. Lego has released a few one-off large cats, but those have been typically in smaller sets. The larger size of the airdrop package meant that fewer of these were sold. So today, if you want one of these tigers for your own personal Lego collection, you'll need to shell out about $40. Speaking of animals though, check out this incredible illustration of a pink elephant wearing a suit and playing poker that was created using Wonder, today's sponsor. Wonder is an app that turns your words into beautiful art using artificial intelligence. Let's create a monkey that's actually an astronaut in space. All right, so using the Wonder app, which you can download with the link in the description, we'll simply type monkey wearing a colorful spacesuit in the Milky Way galaxy. Choose a desired image aspect ratio and click create. Within a few seconds, we'll get our image and all we had to do was type in a few words. Pretty cool, right? Well, this works for more than just animals. You can do cars, avatars, cities, aquatic scenes, nature, or even abstract topics such as the edge of the universe. If you need help bringing an idea to life or creating professional quality artwork, you should use Wonder. Click the link in the description to download Wonder and get a free trial of the premium version to put your creativity to the test. With your premium, you'll unlock 20 styles, faster art generation, unlimited uses, and no ads. So go download Wonder today and have fun creating the most magical or wacky ideas you can think of. All right, now back to the video. The undisputed goat of the Lego barnyard is, well, the goat. Somehow in the last 90 years, Lego has only ever released this goat piece once. Now, I hear you, there are Minecraft goats and we even got the Thor goat boat set. Well, you're right, kind of. You see, it seems that every time Lego decides to release a goat, they end up choosing to make them brick-built sub-builds, except once. 
In 2011, LEGO released the Mill Village Raid in the Kingdoms line, and included in this set was something we had never seen before or since. It was a fully molded goat piece, and the set included two of them. These adorable goats are scaled well with the other farm animals that LEGO has produced and even have a stud on their back. The fact that LEGO has never released these again is truly mind-boggling. They even had the perfect chance when they released the LEGO Ideas Medieval Blacksmith set. The original Ideas project included multiple goat pieces, but when the final version was released to the public, they were nowhere to be seen. So what does LEGO have against goats? Well, we may never know, but perhaps the mold itself isn't even in commission anymore. Nonetheless, due to its rarity, the LEGO goat is worth about 90 US dollars today. Before moving on though, I have to give a shout out to my personal favorite LEGO animal, the classic LEGO monkey. One of the very first animals LEGO ever produced, these iconic creatures used to be in everything up until 2011. Today you can get your own iconic LEGO monkey piece and own a part of LEGO history for about $1. Moving towards the water though, LEGO has released several lizards, snakes, frogs, and crocs over the years. It's no secret that LEGO loves frogs. These little things seem to hop into as many sets as possible, and not just as frogs, but as flower buds, hat toppers, ears, and even occasionally, well, just as frogs themselves. Being so common and so small, it's no surprise that these are some of the cheapest LEGO animals of all time. The light pink frogs from the LEGO bonsai tree can be picked up for less than a penny each because of how many come in this set at such a low price, and even the shiny gold frog is only worth about 5 cents. But there is a legendary frog out there that's worth a lot more. This translucent green frog was only released in four sets from 2000 to 2004. Today, finding one of these is pretty easy, but you'll still need to fork up close to $25, which is the equivalent value of about 2,500 pink frogs. On the other side, the most expensive creepy crawly Lego animal around today is the Basilisk from 2002's Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. These guys sell for about 50 US dollars, but if you're looking for a smaller or cheaper snake, these cobras sell for only 80 cents. And if you're trying to build an entire army of snakes, or you just want to make Indiana Jones squirm, these lime green snakes can be picked up for just a couple cents. Now, making our way under the sea, LEGO has released several high-priced sea creatures. The ability to glow in the dark is very cool, and it's why we love the ghosts from the classic castle sets. Sadly though, the number of glow-in-the-dark pieces of LEGO is limited, so it was great to get such a large one in the form of an octopus in the Mission 7 Deep Sea Quest set from 2008. This piece only really appeared in this one set, but technically you could also pick one up in the pirate ship coin bank, but those weren't very common. This octopus would certainly add great playability to any underwater or pirate scene with its glow-in-the-dark abilities, but with nearly a $50 price tag, you may just want to keep it firmly inside a display case. Now, LEGO has put out a few different dolphins in a range of colors, and this one in particular looks especially good in translucent blue. But the fancy color isn't what makes this piece valuable. This dolphin is actually a rare example of a LEGO design fail. It seems that this piece featured an abnormal connection on the bottom that was a little too narrow to properly hold the two studs that would normally fit for a connection, and also too small to fit a Technic axle. It would, though, loosely accept a LEGO bar. For this reason, this dolphin now costs close to $100. If that's a bit too deep for your pockets, you can pick up the same model in gray, and with a functioning connection on the bottom, of course, for just about $1. Now, of course, I can't talk about LEGO sea creatures without mentioning the shark, specifically the Sharkinator from Antimatter's Portal Hideout set of 2015. Both the figure and the set are now incredibly hard to get a hold of these days. If you're lucky enough to find one for sale, expect to pay close to $75. While not being as big or flashy, this little green seahorse was only ever released in 2005's Mermaid Castle set, and today this tiny piece runs for about $15 to $20. But if you want to just fill an aquarium, you can't go wrong with a hundred crabs. These, especially in bright orange, are only worth one to two cents a pop. Now, of course, LEGO is no stranger to fantasy or history. LEGO dinosaurs are some of the biggest and most valuable animals the company has ever released. But you actually don't need to break the bank to start up your very own Jurassic Park. The baby dinosaur piece comes in a huge selection of colors, and the value of these is all over the place. This plain one with no pattern can be picked up for around 40 cents, while many of the others sell in the 80 cent to $2 range. 
but the priciest of them all is this black and green one that goes for about $3. While these small dinos aren't too pricey, some of the parents are. You see, LEGO has only ever released one adult Ankylosaurus, and getting a hold of one today will set you back around 50 bucks. This dino was released in 2020 as part of one of the sets, which gave us not one, but two incredibly valuable dino figures. The Indominus Rex has been released twice, and the version from this set is worth about 35 bucks. If you got your hands on the earlier set, the Indominus Rex Breakout, you also got the first version, which is now worth about $75, making it the priciest dinosaur figure out there. Now, there's a whole category of animals that haven't even been touched on yet. Fantastic Beasts. LEGO has recreated some of the most famous legendary monsters from mythology and pop culture, and a few of these are true collector's items. The very earliest fantasy creature that LEGO gave us was the classic green dragon from the original castle theme. Today, these are prized by many people for the nostalgia they represent, but they aren't especially valuable. A used one can be picked up for around $3, and even a new one is only worth about 15 bucks. But LEGO dragons can get much more fearsome than that. One of the most famous dragons from recent years is the legendary Hungarian Horntail from Harry Potter. This was actually the first of three variants LEGO has made, and it's the only one to not be brick-built, which gives it a serious edge over the others. This figure looks a lot sleeker than the other two, and proves that design doesn't always get better over time. Released in Harry and the Hungarian Horntail in 2005, this dragon now costs between $80 to $100. Keeping in the wizarding world, there's a surprisingly cheap piece that most people would love to have in their collection. Harry's Stag Patronus was only ever released in a single set, Expecto Patronum, in 2019. This beautiful translucent blue colored deer really flew under the radar on release, and today you can summon your very own for just two to three dollars, which I think is a great deal. Check it out in the description using YouTube's shopping feature. Moving from one blockbuster franchise to another, any Star Wars fan knows the famous scene under Jabba's palace where Luke is forced to battle the mighty reptilian hulk, the Rancor. This figure has only featured once in the Rancor Pit set, released in 2013, and LEGO did a great job in capturing its muscular textures, disproportionately long arms, monstrous hands, and dagger-like claws. The figure's rarity, the quality of its design, and the insanely high popularity of Star Wars amongst both LEGO and non-LEGO collectors alike is why the Rancor is now priced at more than $125. But the crown for the most expensive LEGO animal figure has got to go to the Smog from 2014's The Lonely Mountain set. It's a very accurate replica of how he's shown in the second Hobbit film. The rarity, impressive nature of this figure, and the high popularity of all things Middle Earth are what has pushed the smog to the top spot, with a price of close to $300 for a new one. But of course, there are a ton more LEGO animals out there. Click here to see the full evolution of LEGO animals. Download Wondered with the link in the description, and subscribe for more LEGO videos.